Good morning, good people. This is your Poolproof Wisdom Moment for a Friday. A Friday as we continue to hurdle through the month of December on toward the holidays and hopefully with a sense of possibility guiding our way every step of the way so that we are looking forward to what's ahead as opposed to regretting the idea that it's on its way in the first place. A lot of people get so wrapped up in these things that we often miss the magic that really can come from these holiday celebrations, the things that we can learn about ourselves and others that remind us that we share this planet in a way that helps each of us grow if we're willing to learn the lessons that we are able to pick up along the way. Today, I want to talk to you a little bit about what it means to have a perspective in your life that defines who you are. And what I'm calling that is your setting. What is your direct setting that you go to that would describe how you enter the world every day from the moment you get up to the moment you go to bed? What is that default setting that you are on? Some people wake up always angry. Some people wake up anxious. And all through the day, that is what defines how they are going through that day, how they are interacting with people. Is your default setting something that is not helping you elevate your experience of living versus actually looking at life in a different way that makes you joyful for being here? Now, I'll tell you, I've got a number of default settings, but if I were forced to come up with one, It's that my default setting is always hope. I wake up and go to bed every day hopeful. I don't know what will happen. I don't always know what can happen, but I always hope for the best and if not the best, for the resources and the means to find a way to deal whatever comes my way, whatever impacts my life. So that's my default setting. During the course of any day, there are other ones that I may veer off to. There's joy, there's laughter, there's insight, there's faith, of course. So all of these are individual default settings, but they do fall under the umbrella of hope. And I think that once you know what your default setting is, if it's something that, again, propels you forward in a positive way, this is a very good thing. You should go ahead and acknowledge, embrace, and love that default setting. But if your default setting is something that keeps you mired in this muck, that only makes you angry, frustrated, only see the negative possibilities, You need to start doing some work with yourself and with someone else to help you figure out why that is your default setting and God willing, get yourself everything that you need to ensure that you work yourself out of that and to a default setting that is going to make your life more meaningful, more worthwhile, and certainly something that you look forward to. That's not just during this holiday season, that's every day of the year. And if that becomes your possibility and you shift your default from something negative to something positive, not only do you benefit, good person, but the entire world benefits with you. And that's your Poolproof Wisdom Moment for today. Here I am wishing you a wonderful weekend. Don't overdo things. Enjoy what's going on, but don't exhaust yourself. Leave time for memories making them and both remembering them, and also for an opportunity to actually enjoy what you're doing. That is what's the meaning of the holiday season. Joy, possibility, hope, and a whole lot of faith based upon the idea of what these holidays are supposed to be. Let us not lose that by going out and acting like it's only about commerce and about anything else other than the sense of hope and joy that comes with the season. I'll see you all next week. Have a great weekend.